The Kenya Union of Sugarcane Plantation and Allied Workers insists they will only withdraw a case they filed, challenging the planned leasing of state mills if they are included officially in the Caretaker Committee Gazette recently, gazetted recently by Agriculture CS Peter Munya. Here's Laura Tierno with the details. Only a day after signing a commitment to the Lake Region Economic Bloc leadership to withdraw the case filed at a Kisumu court last week, the union says a seat at the negotiation table is all that will see them act. We'll argue our position when we are in the committee. I know that when they, they cassetted the committee, they said that the interested parties can submit their memorandums. What have you? Ours, we are not interested parties. We are the owners of this process. In the deal, LREB and the union affirmed that the salary areas and statutory deductions of employees of the mills must be considered in the leasing process. LREB also promised to have Francis Wangara, Kuz Power Secretary General, join the Interim Management Committee on leasing of the state-owned sugar mills. We are saying that after the settlement is when we withdraw the case. But when, when we come to the stage of withdrawal, there is a process which will follow before we withdraw. In the court documents, the union had claimed that the five state-owned factories, namely Chemelil Sugar, Muhoroni Sugar, Nzoya Sugar, Miwani and Sony Sugar, owe them a cumulative 3.5 billion shillings in arrears. Last week, ODM party leader Raila Odinga waded into the matter, appealing with the union to withdraw the case to give the millers a fighting chance once again. Laura Otieno, Citizen